bro. You better be subscribed right now if you're still watching. We're back at it. Follow me, follow me. We're here at Best Buy looking for a tripod. Don't know why. Oh, you don't? Okay. We actually need a tripod because we're going to Yellowstone this week. I don't want to be able to get good pictures, good videos, stuff that I don't want to have to hold the camera for, you know? They didn't have it. They really didn't have it. All right, we got our tripod. We're going to Yellowstone, like we said. You know, we just, it, summer's coming to an end. We need to hit it off with a bang. We need to end it off with a bang, and there's no other two miles, way to take do it. exit one onto I-80 East and Silver Creek Road toward Cheyenne. Thanks. For some reason, since high school, it's just always been in the back of my mind, like, one summer I'm gonna go to Yellowstone. It's never happened. It was just coming to the end of summer and I was like, we should go to Yellowstone, why not? We're not really doing anything. We don't have anything holding us back in our schedules. The right lane to take exit one onto I-80 East. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Anyways, so we're available. We can go to Yellowstone right now, so why not? What other time can we just pick up and go to Yellowstone? It'll be fun. We have a six hour drive ahead of us. Yeah. Thanks and a half hour. It's like Six, seven hours overall. Seven hours seven overall. Hours overall. So. Daisha's going back up to school and I'm going back to work. Um, yeah, our grand finale of the fun season. Yep. Right here. Yep. Oh, teepees. It's got a lot of cool guys. No. Well, we just got pulled over. Didn't get a ticket though. I think it was just, he's just trying to meet the, you know, just trying to meet the quota. All that. Oh, jeez. Look at that storm. What if it didn't work? <laughs> yeah, it's been a long day. A lot of driving, a lot of hectic roadblocks. Let's go to sleep. How'd you sleep? Really well. Huh? So good. Can you guess why? Probably because we stayed at a hotel. We had an accident on the way to our campsite and it would have been another three or four hour drive just to get back to it. So I ended up staying here at this Roosevelt Hotel. We got here late last night, still made it just in time to get into the room. So we can officially begin our Yellowstone experience, right? Yes. No. Oh. <laughs> Barely made it in. <laughs> so what's the fun fact about this arch? Okay, so this is the Roosevelt Arch, and this is like the original, like main entrance to Yellowstone. It's still an entrance, but it used to be like the big main attraction. Like, it's just an arch, bro. It's not that deep. No, I'm, I'm not talking. I'm talking to. Wait, who built this, Roosevelt? Bro, that thing is looking at me. We literally have some moose just pulling up to the campsite. We were driving to our camp or our hotel last night and we saw a moose in the road and we literally just saw the silhouette of it. it just freaked me out. All right, we got the campsite set up. Luckily, it stopped raining just for like about an hour. It's been raining the whole time, so the fact that it stopped for right now is a miracle. <laughs> Check this door out. Go buff. Go buff, baby. Go buff. Okay, so I totally didn't just spend 80 bucks on two three-day fishing passes or licenses, so fishing just became a trip priority. And good thing we have this little brochure here that'll tell us where we can go fishing and stuff. So we're gonna go try and hunt for a spot right now and get some fishing in while we can. Well, while Daisha's getting the wood, when well, she went to go get some more wood, and I have you all to myself, I just want to say how much I appreciate Daisha. She had a whole agenda, like, of things for us to do. Like, hours, down to travel times, all that stuff. 
everything that it's been so far, you know, rainy, couldn't get to our campsite last night, hotel, moving around, rainy again. You know, a lot of the sites aren't what they could be, uh, but they're everything that they should be, you know what I mean? And um, just wanted to, you know, express my gratitude and uh, appreciation for Daisha. So, if you're watching this part in the video, I know I've been pretty sleepy. I think I took like three allergy pills this morning and it's like totally like knocked me out of the game. But yeah, I just want you to know I appreciate you. I'm grateful that we were able to come on this trip and uh, get to Yellowstone, somewhere that I've always wanted to be, always wanted to go. And uh, even though it's cloudy, it feels pretty sunny, you know what I mean? So. All right, well, after we eat dinner, probably gonna call it a night, wake up tomorrow, um, and explore the rest of Yellowstone. You know what I'm saying? These hot dogs are as good as ever. Tomorrow we're about hamburgers, yeah, we're basic, so what? Anyways, see y'all tomorrow.